A Victorian doctor is leading the way in finding a cure for snoring and sleep apnea. As obesity levels rise, so too does the number of people suffering the debilitating condition. But help is at hand, as Jennifer Kite explains. For Manuel Papyrus, a good night's sleep is just a dream. You feel like you've, you've, you've run a marathon, you know, it's basically you've, you've been working in your sleep. A chronic snorer. His sleep apnea is so bad, he stops breathing countless times every night. His condition is taking a heavy toll on his life and also his family. I could be in two rooms away from the bedroom and I can hear. So it's not something that you can sleep through. And we see people who are suitable can have their sleep apnea cured. Today, Manuel is hoping he's one of those people. The procedure called coblation tongue channeling involves shrinking the back of the tongue using a plasma wand and radio frequency energy while the patient is under general anaesthetic. The wand dissolves the tissue and muscle at a low temperature with almost no pain and discomfort afterwards. When the excess tissue has shrunk away, the tongue no longer collapses into the airway while you sleep, effectively curing snoring and sleep apnea, and in some cases reducing the size of the tongue by 20 cubic centimetres. Up to 50% of snoring and sleep apnea sufferers fit the criteria for the procedure. Snoring and sleep apnea affect up to 25% of Australian adults and anyone who suffers from snoring or has a partner who does knows just how debilitating it can be. Moodiness, extreme fatigue and physical impairment are some of the milder symptoms. It can also be deadly. Well, it's a very dangerous problem if it's not treated. We need to get on top of it so that patients don't run a risk of, uh, of hypertension and cardiovascular disease. So it can have a very big impact on the quality of their life and the length of their life. As soon as I stopped, and even if I sat on the couch with the kids, I'd end up falling asleep. Electrician Jason Stain suffered a chronic snoring problem for 10 years. But since having the surgery, he's a new man. Do it, because you won't look back. Jennifer Kite, 7 News.